What's going on guys, it's your boy JP here and today I'm going to be bringing you yet another build for your Android TV box, Fire Stick and PC. This one is Artemis, it is from the Pulse Collection. If you guys want to go check out all the other Pulse builds, I'll have a link down below in the description so you guys can go check that out. But anyways, let's get right into the video. Like always, I'm going to be showing you what you get and then I'll be showing you how to get it. This builds Artemis and as you can see here, the menus are in nice red and i like that a lot it's pretty simple pretty easy to navigate and you got everything that you need here uh, like always pulls they always got simplistic builds but they're always packed with a lot of add-ons that you you're gonna enjoy so that's what i like about the pulse but anyways let's go right into the video the first menu that you get you get the uk turk you get the two uh turk movies turk live tv turk documentaries turk tv shows and turk sports if you go in the actual uk turk menu it'll bring you to the uh out on itself so you guys can go check that out uh, if you keep moving to the side, you go. You got the main cave uh, menu here at the bottom. You have the Sky Sports. You got classic British comedy, the MJM uh, Sky Sports. You got the one-on-one -on -one gangster movies for all the gangsters out there. You got the movie box sets because a lot of people like the movie box sets. And if you keep going, you got the female movies and you have the Valhalla boxes box sets as well if you click on the actual main cave you'll get to this uh uh to the phoenix 124 24 15 add-on and we'll get everything here that you guys want to check out if you keep moving to the side you got the music menu you guys can check that out. i'm not gonna go into it because it's just uh, streaming websites and add-ons for the move for the music if you go into the new mu new movies at the bottom here you have the different add-ons that you can use you have the watch 1080p calls eyes one two three movies current movies that's for the menu you got the velocity you have the perfect hd movies you got the pop film you have a uh, neater or nighter you got entertainment hub and uh if you go in the actual new movies menu it'll bring you to the uh entertainment hub add-on as the default as you can see here you have the different box office feature top movies latest movies and so on and so forth so you guys can kind of check that out if you go into the TV shows again, you got at the bottom the different uh, add-ons that you can use for that as well. And if you go into the TV shows, it uses the uh, it uses the release hub as well for the uh, for the default add-on. If you keep moving to the side, you have the favorites and favorites. You have the stream engine, you have the app bus, uh, bus you have the rubber cup concerts, and then so on and so forth. You got a bunch of different menus here. If, what you guys for you guys to come check out if you keep moving you have the phoenix add-on one of the top add-ons out there for anything for tv shows movies live stream and sports you guys can come here and check that out uh rock crusher is not being supported anymore but uh, i'm pretty sure i got a feeling he's gonna come back because uh he's uh, he's pretty good and i got a feeling he's gonna come back hopefully he comes back so let's cross our fingers so he comes back. Yeah, the Valhalla, which it's uh, movies, sports, and everything else. You guys can check out the uh, Phoenix uh, add-on there. In the sports section, you have Sky Sports, Woody Sports, Money Sports, Valhalla, Live Premium, uh, Live Premium Sports. Uh, you got the RoboCop, Sports Devil, C Cloud Sports, and Torque Sports. And if you keep moving, you get the movies, and in movies, you get all the different movies. Uh, it uses the Phoenix add on as well. If you go on the perfect HD, uh, you got the different add ons at the bottom here to check out. If you go on the apps, it's just show you all the different add ons that you have at the bottom here. You have the raw maintenance, you have Cody, uh, Cody Help videos uh, from a YouTuber. I'm not sure who it is, I haven't checked it out, but go ahead and check that out. Like him and subscribe for. Uh, I'm pretty sure there's support from the developers. You got the fresh start, you got the backup and add-on installer for you to install any other add-on that you would want. Anyways, let's get right into the tutorial. I'm going to be showing you how to get it now. You want to go into system, file manager. It's going to be a little bit different for you if you have the default skin. But anyways, just go into the system and then scroll down to file manager. 
once you file manager we're going to be adding a source go ahead and click add source it's going to be down below in the description and also if you're going to be copying straight letter for letter make sure you don't misspell anything make sure there's no spaces at the front or back after that click done we're going to be naming it dot rs to that so it, so it goes to the top of the list that way you guys don't have to search for it after you add everything else click uh, uh, i'll click ok and then we're going to be going back into system we're going to be going into add-ons once in add-ons go and stop from zip file click on that and then we're going to be looking for the rs wizard go ahead and click on the first one and the only one there go ahead and install it's going to take around 10 to 15 seconds to enable and once it's enabled you guys can go ahead and install from repository so we're going to be waiting just a little bit longer just for it to install and then we're going to be going into the install from repository so let's go ahead and go into the install from repository after it's been enabled go into the rs project once in rs project you're going to go ahead and click on program add-ons you're going to find the rs wizard there so let's go ahead and click on it and wait for it to load it is checking for updates so it is going to be interwining with everything that's going on right now so it's going to be a little bit slower but as you can see here you have the rs wizard once in RS Wizard, go ahead and click on it and install it. As you can see here, I already have it. Once you install it, go back all the way to the uh, home page. As you can see here, mine's different. So you want to go into programs. Once you go into programs, you're going to go into the RS Wizard. Once in RS Wizard, we're going to be going and looking for the build. So go ahead and click on the browse build. So I'm just going to wait for it to load. There we go. Go ahead and click on the browse builds. Once here, go into the pulse collection. And we're going to be installing this one right here the rms if you already have a build installed or anything installed that you don't want to have it then go ahead and click fresh start i recommend doing that before installing any build go ahead and i'm sorry go ahead and click fresh start uh, once you click fresh start go ahead and uh, close cody and uh, restart cody if you're running on a pc restart it if you're running on an android box close it out open it up and then uh, go ahead and click install afterwards go look for the rms click install and uh, that's pretty much it if you're running on a pc you don't have to worry about anything just force close and then open it up again after it's done installing if you're running on an android tv box or fire stick or anything android related you're going to want to unplug it from the power source and then plug it back to the power source and then you can uh, start up cody again that's pretty much it for this video guys make sure you like subscribe and comment don't forget to uh leave a comment down below saying which one is your favorite build and which one you use the most i'll see you guys in my next video peace